we was that army that the older guys was waiting for. Right. To turn that whole system around. Because when you look at the prison system in the 70s, every state had its riots. Right. Right? Because those leaders from the movement in the 60s were behind the in wall. The prison. And they was demanding changes. And so my generation, when we came there, we were that army right. that they was waiting on. That supported them. Yeah. And their ideas. And you saw gang activities dis decreasing on the streets in the 70s. But getting very powerful in prison. Behind the wall. And if you look at all the leadership was behind the wall. You know, Lord Gino, who ran all the Latin Kings, was behind the wall. Mm -hmm. Jeff Ford of the Stones was behind the wall. Bobby Gore, Mongoose, all them, or the Vice wow. was behind the wall. Uh, Larry Hoover, all them was behind the wall. So the leadership was behind the wall. And that left us, just like today, it left us out here. Right. But what we did, we got caught in the getting house drugs, pimping and hustling. But this generation, when they locked up all the leaders during the early 2000s, right, and left these little guys out here and they started forming little cliques and stuff. And they had already declared a war on these drug cartels and start trialing them up under the RICO Act. Right. The same method they used to bring the American mafia down, they used the same method to bring down the organized street gangs and stop calling them street gangs and start calling them organized crime to justify the RICO, RICO Act. Act. 